the new hybrid engine, Mazda 2 Super Mini, is on sale in the UK now, with prices starting from £20,300. It's a new car to Mazda's lineup, but it should look very familiar to buyers, as it's essentially a rebadged version of the latest Toyota Yaris Hybrid. The Super Mini was launched as part of a collaborative venture between Toyota and Mazda, which has the aim of advancing the latter company's electrification strategy. It will become the first full hybrid model in Mazda's range when deliveries start in May. The dimension of Mazda 2 is 3,940mm long, 1,745mm wide, and 1,500mm high, the new Mazda 2 Hybrid is one of the most compact vehicles in the B segment. Its small footprint, short front and rear overhangs, and tight, class-leading 4.9-meter turning circle make it equally at home in a congested urban environment and on the open road. Buyers have a choice of three specifications called Pure, Agile, and Select. Standard equipment for the base model includes 15-inch steel wheels, automatic windscreen wipers, air conditioning, and a 7-inch infotainment system. There's also a decent amount of safety equipment, such as a traffic sign recognition system and lane departure warning. The mid-range Mazda 2 Hybrid Agile has a starting price of £21,150. Improvements over the cheaper, pure specification include 15-inch alloy wheels, a reversing camera, keyless entry, and an 8-inch infotainment system. The new Mazda 2 Hybrid will be built by Toyota, but marketed by Mazda, helping the latter firm save on development costs, yet benefit from reduced fleet average CO2 emissions. The existing petrol-powered Mazda 2, which was recently updated for the 2022 model year, will be sold alongside the new hybrid model to offer customers in the Super Mini segment the choice of two distinct models depending on their needs. The self-charging Mazda 2 Hybrid is a full-series parallel hybrid capable of operating in petrol and electric modes alone, as well as a combination of both. It delivers seamless acceleration and remarkably quiet operation, particularly in urban environments, whilst returning excellent fuel efficiency and the lowest possible emissions. The 1.5-litre full hybrid system features a petrol engine, a powerful electric motor, a generator, a high-performance 177.6V lithium-ion battery, a power control unit, and a power split device. The electric motor, generator, and power split device are all housed in a compact transmission casing the size of a conventional gearbox. Unlike a conventional, belt-driven CVT transmission, the hybrid system delivers driving torque through a power split device in the form of a planetary gear set which combines and reallocates power from the engine, electric motor, and generator, according to operational requirements. Located under the rear passenger seat, the lithium-ion battery has a high power density and is better able to supply current flow than nickel-metal hydride alternatives. It can also recover energy under braking more efficiently and recharge the battery more quickly, enhancing the vehicle's EV performance during urban driving. System power is provided by a 1,490cc, three-cylinder Atkinson, cycle petrol engine, developing 92 DIN HP 68 kilowatts and 120 newton meters of torque, and a permanent magnet, synchronous 59 kilowatts electric motor, generating instant torque, from zero revolutions per minute and a maximum, of 141 newton meters at 17,000 revolutions per minute. The petrol engine and electric motor combine to give a total system power of 116 DIN HP, 85 kilowatts. Thanks for watching and give your comments below.